what's good youtube it's your boy dr pgad i'm praise gotta get money back for another youtube video banger man yes sir yes man i know what time it is the doctor's in the house man we have some news man we have some news we have some news man so it is official as referee with a whistle man we have daniel dubois versus anthony joshua um in wembley stadium on september 21st man so look check me out man all my english brethren and sister grab your crumpets grab your fish and chips you know what i'm talking about and we gonna see you in wembley bruv you know what i'm talking about we gonna party you know what i'm talking about because p diddy be wanting the body and you gotta tell him no oh, you Lord. got to tell him no <laughs> we going to party me out. These fights going to be good. And because Daniel Dubois was elevated to the IBF full champion, man, it's going to be for the IBF belt, man. You know, the IBF don't play, man. The IBF be stripping fools. Well, well, the IBF don't play unless you're a certain person. If you know, you know. You know what I'm talking about? He come closer than I, I, I fuck him. Huh? So, yeah. So, the IBF, uh, they don't play. They play a little bit. <laughs> But they mostly don't play, man. They stripped it. Um, they they stripped uh, Alexander Usyk, or you could say he vacated. However, you want to say well, whatever route was taken. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, the same result is that, or the result is the same is that uh, he he's lost the IBF belt, whether he gave it up or he was stripped. Anthony and Daniel, listen. I know IBF title important to you. Tell it my present to you on September 21. And um, his rematch with Tyson Fury, unfortunately, won't be for the Undisputed, which I think is kind of a, uh, I think it's kind of a letdown, you know what I'm saying? But at the same time, you know, the IBF, they did want um, Philip Hergovich and, and Daniel Dubois' fight that just happened in the 5v5 Queensberry Batchroom fight to be for the IBF title. So it kind of in a roundabout way is. So that's why I don't really see, you know, a lot of people would say that um, when you, once you get elevated, you're like an email champ, you know, they got emailed to you. But I kind of think a lot of times people are right. But in this case, Daniel Dubois was an interim champion already. And um, I kind of still recognize the Philip Hergovich versus Daniel Dubois fight as like a, like a, like a title fight, you know what I'm saying? So this one is a little different. And I'll knock uh, Daniel Dubois for, for that because he, he was on the street with some good wins against Jarrell Jer Jer Big Baby Miller and um and Philip Hergovich man he looked very impressive against him so I'm not mad at this too much you know I know some people will let me know in the comments what you think about that but anyway at the end of the day man we have uh, Daniel Dubois versus Anthony Joshua I think it's gonna be a great fight I called this uh before you know a lot of people didn't believe me <laughs> They said, ain't no way Anthony Joshua fight Daniel Dubois. I said, bro, I said, Daniel Dubois beats Philip Hergovich, man. You know, I think I think Anthony Joshua will fight him. I'm not saying that he wouldn't fight Philip Hergovich as well. I just thought that it was a bigger and better chance that he'll fight Daniel Dubois in, 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 in the in the event that he wins. You know what I'm saying? Um, And uh, because Daniel Dubois, let's face it, he's looked at as a, as an easier opposition. You know what I'm saying? An easier competition. And that's that's what we have now. You know, um, Anthony Joshua just wasn't possible to fight the winner of Alexander Usyk and Tyson Free because... Regardless of who won, they already established that they were going to have a rematch. So, you know, he wasn't going to sit down and wait that long. And I didn't think that he would fight Joseph Parker, you know, since he already beat him. Um, so, yeah. So, Daniel Dubois versus Anthony Joshua Matthews is a good fight. I think a lot of people are um, are uh, counting out Daniel Dubois again. You dumbass. You know, I think they're doing that prematurely. Um, do I think Anthony Joshua is the favorite? Yeah. Do I think he should be the favorite? Yeah. Um, but am I down in Dubois? Am I counting him out? Hell no. I don't know who's going to win this, man. I'm, I'm going to tell you right now. It depends on how the numbers look. If Danny Dubois is a heavy, heavy underdog, I might be leaning towards my boy Dubois. <laughs> You know what I'm talking about? So I, I don't know, but we'll, we'll see though, man. As of right now, early prediction, I'm going to go with the smart money and I'm going to lead. I'm going to lean towards Anthony Joshua because Anthony Joshua has been looking for sensational lately, even though it could be kind of, if you really look at it analytically and not surface level, you could kind of say it's been kind of, um, could possibly be spoke in beers because his last two fights he looked great one was against uh francis and man who i think is a fighting phenom but he's still not a um not a boxer he's still an mma fighter and so he, he demolished him as he was supposed to anthony joshua had to blitz him right now i had to blitz him if I was oh my god oh my god you know in the boxing ring and then his other fight before that was against Otto Wallen who he was very familiar with you know being a former sparring partner and all that good stuff so you know while he did look sensational we do have to consider those things I'm not knocking it I'm just saying you have to consider those things you know what I'm talking about and um, that's what I'm here to do you know so um looking at all angles their last two opponents Daniel Dubois definitely has a tougher competition you know being Hergovich and Gerald Big Baby Biller and I say Big Baby Big Baby Bill is the best but you know he got that uh them drugs in the system you know what I'm talking about <laughs> So, so you can argue that Daniel Dubois, being the smaller man, was fighting Jarrell Big Baby, Big Baby Miller. What? 
Jarrell Big Baby Miller's weight, what? his excess weight, and Jarrell Big Baby Miller's PEDs. You know what I'm talking about? Oh, the residual yeah. effects of the PEDs. So, uh, so Danny Dubois, he, his, his last two opponents, especially Philip Hergovich, man, a lot of people are discrediting Philip Hergovich, saying that he was a fraud because he lost to Danny Dubois. No, he was still, he's, he's still who I thought he was. He's still a good fighter. He's still a threat. It's just that Daniel Dubois is that much more impressive, especially on that night of the 5v5, man. So don't discredit Daniel Dubois and say Philip Hergovich is not who we thought he was. It's just that Daniel Dubois is not who we thought he was, and he's actually better than what we thought he was. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? So I think this is a great fight. Um, like I said, I'm going to lean towards Anthony Joshua right now, but I'm going to do some more an an uh, analysis and let y'all know, man. Get, keep y'all updated, man. Appreciate y'all rocking me as always. See you in twenty. See you in uh, Wembley, September 21. You know what I'm talking about? Good Lord willing, man. I can't wait for this fight. It's going to be a great heavyweight showdown, man. Y'all be easy. Take care of yourselves. Remember, with God, we can do anything. Without God, we are nothing. The doctor's out. Peace. From the hood to college, both worlds, they had to meet. Six degrees between us, so cold, we're about to freeze. But we're Florida boys, hot takes, we bring the heat. We're moving the culture, the engineers to the streets.